what's up y'all welcome back to your girl channel my name is mo if you're new if most of you guys do not know already shein sells home items from kitchen bedroom living room closet like you name it they have it i just purchased my first house and i thought that this video would be perfect because i tried to show you guys little clips of me styling the items in my home I tried to pick up different categories for this video so you guys can get an idea of like a kitchen you have a bedroom you have a bathroom you know different items that you can style in your home as always the links will be in the description listed in the order that i list them in this video hope that made sense there's also a discount code in the description box as well for you guys to save extra money at checkout so make sure you guys are saving your coins and getting you some good deals on these home items. Let's go ahead and get into the pieces. First, we're gonna start off with my most favorite, which is my bedroom. Here is one of the throw pillows. I actually had to go back and get another one because I loved it so much, but it is in this linen color. And then it has, I wanna say that this is like a beigeish gray. It can kind of go for both depending on what you style it on. And then it has black at the bottom. So on my bed, which I'm gonna show you guys a little clip, I actually did get one of their duvet covers and it came with two pillows and then obviously the duvet cover. And I thought that that color would go perfect with these pillows, so that's the one that I decided to go with. And the comforter was actually very, very comfortable. You guys, I have washed it, put it back on my bed, washed it again, put it on my bed. You don't get like any of those bubble feelings. It doesn't make you like really hot or anything like that. So I really love the comforter and I love that I styled it with this pillow. You wanna make sure that you get you some inserts because they don't come with that, it's just, the cover but like for the price i want to say between five and seven dollars you can't beat it next we have this little throw blanket it is so freaking soft i wish i would have got at the biggest size i want to say that this is the smallest one so it's nice to kind of like throw over like your bed or if you wanted to throw it on your couch i know i'm gonna be honest i gave this to my dog because she really loves like fluffy things and it fit in her bed perfectly obviously it's washed but this color is so cute and i love her you know bedding and everything to match my room my aesthetic and all that stuff like that so got this it's really soft and comfortable so if you wanted to get this for you personally it'll fit perfectly now while we're still on to the bedroom i wanted to show you guys this because it is perfect if you love reading at night like right before you go to bed this little light you basically just put over the book and you read it you don't have to have any lights on in the bedroom so this was perfect it was a nice little you know like okay i didn't know i needed that until i actually got it it does not come with batteries so make sure that you have i want to say it's AAA batteries to put inside but yeah i did pick out a few prints to go in the bathroom i'm not 100 percent sure if i'm going to use them quite yet but this here is one of the prints it looks really cute i want to say up close yes it kind of gives off that like printed look but like from a distance you really can't tell it's definitely a vibe i like it this here is the next one now obviously guys i don't have like any picture frames or anything to put them in yet so i wasn't able to like show them hung up on the wall so i'm sorry about that and then this is the last one i feel like they're really cute they're different um they are in like this i want to say cloth material so it's not easy to rip, you know, you put them in the frame. I feel like they're gonna last a really long time. It's just like I said, up front, it kind of gives off like that printed look, but from a distance, you can't tell. Now, while we're on the bathroom topic, I picked up these really cute shampoo, conditioner, and body wash bottles. I have a guest bedroom, bed, bedroom. I have a guest bathroom that I still need to kind of like style and everything. And these will be really perfect. I did have to put the labels on myself because I really don't know how to do that well. Like they didn't really turn out like perfectly, but I feel like they're really cute. They're gonna be a nice little touch to add to your bathroom. Even if it's like your main bathroom, you kind of need these. And to kind of top it off, I got one of these shelves to put in my guest bathroom as well. I do actually have this exact shelf in my main bathroom and I really love it. It has not fallen or anything. I have bottles, I have a brush, I have literally a lot of things like piled up on the shelf and it hasn't fallen yet so i want to say it's like a really good heavy duty it's black it goes with anything so if you end up changing your bottles it will be really perfect now this honestly has to be one of my other favorite items because i didn't know shein sold vases that look like this okay vases like this easily cost 20 plus and for something like 
about this size yeah it's gonna be about 20 25 maybe 30 dollars the vase is really cute it's definitely a vibe i picked up this pumpus as well to go inside of it i kind of wanted like a black on black moment and with this it just comes with like one stem so it's definitely thick enough to fit one little vase like this if you wanted multiple obviously you would need multiple but i feel like one kind of fits it perfectly the last thing that i'm going to be putting in my guest bathroom is going to be this toilet tissue holder i have been looking on websites for this specific item and they have been like so expensive that i just feel like okay maybe i just need a regular toilet tissue holder but i finally found this one obviously on shein and it looks so nice black and sleek and then in the inside basically you can put things in now my thought process on this was i do have guests come over and they're in my guest bathroom i'm not having to have them go underneath my sink i can put you know toiletry things inside of the little shelf next we're gonna go on to the kitchen items i have been dying to get one of these and i finally have one and she and had it like at a, like i said a really affordable price i want to say maybe 15 bucks I don't know it'll be linked down below for y'all but it's perfect because in the mornings i normally make two sausages and two eggs and then i make a piece of toast on the side okay this was like made for me and it matches like all of my pots and pans perfectly yeah it's just you need this if you have not gotten one already like girl you need it if you are a tea girly or a coffee girly these you really really need I have all gold utensils in my house now and I thought that these would be so cute and perfect like when I'm making tea. Um, the spoon is like big enough, it's not like really small that I can mix my tea or add little sugars or whatever I need to to it but I think it's really cute and especially if you have like a coffee station, tea station, you can set these up. I don't know, they're just really really cute. Now to top it off with making your tea or your coffee sis like do you see this mug i have never seen anything like this it's so cute in the inside it has like a little smiley face i just thought that this was such a unique mug like i have never seen anything like this i know i just said that but it's cute it's like a standard mug size it's not oversized it's just tall that gives it that illusion that it's bigger but it's so stinking cute. I cannot wait to use it, especially to make like my matchas in the morning. I don't like really huge matchas. I like to sip on it like regular tea and this is gonna be the perfect look up. So next, we have another mug. It comes with a little plate and you have your mug. I feel like this one is very, very chunky. It's not gonna be easy to break just because it's easy to hold but like in the inside it's a standard mug it's just really cute definitely aesthetically pleasing so like i said if you have like a coffee station or tea station or something like and you wanted to display a really nice mug like this would be the perfect little one this here is like a better close-up on the mug i know i didn't do you know a nice little clip for that but it's really really cute you need it i promise you need it hopefully soon i'm gonna be hosting some brunches or like little mini parties with some of the people that i'm cool with and i thought that this would be really cute because i have a lot of gold and clear like containers and stuff that i would use for parties and this would be so cute i have no idea on what i would put in this just yet but i i'm thinking like you know m ms and um skittles i don't really eat candy like that but you know you know the vibes like you could put stuff in here they are plastic um so keep that in mind this here is a metal piece on the outside and you can actually hold it like a little tray they are removable so you don't have to use the tray if you don't want to but she's cute and the last little kitchen item is this utensil set it does come with the container you have a fork and a spoon and then you actually have some chopsticks too. I do bring lunch to work a lot. So me using like plastic and all that stuff, I just feel like it kind of adds up and it's a waste of money at this point. So I thought that this would be perfect for work. It is in this cow print detail. I thought it just would be different. It's giving like that old fashioned theme as well. But if you're that girl that loves to take your lunch, definitely get you one of these and start bringing your silverware to work, okay? The last item that I have is this bucket. It is one of those like 
scrunchy buckets and obviously I can't do it on camera by myself. I have to put it down, but you can scrunch the bucket up so that it's, you know, small. I decided that I wanted to use this for the bucket to wash my car. I don't know. I needed a really cute little stylish bucket. I feel like everyone else has like those Home Depot buckets and just painter buckets and I didn't want one of those. So this one would be really cute to wash my car. What I've been doing is after washing the car is putting all of my stuff inside of here. That way it's just kind of like easy. Bring it outside, come back inside. You know, it's all in one spot. All right, babe. So that is everything that I got from Shein. I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. I know it's a little bit different from my clothing hauls, but the Shein home is definitely where it's at. If you want to save you some money and definitely decorate your home or get you those items that you didn't know that you needed, Shein is the way to go. If y'all have any questions about anything, make sure y'all leave a comment down below. If y'all would love to see more videos like this, make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and as always, I'll see you guys in my next video.